Hello everyone, it's me Connie and I am just working on some things and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna take you along with you, but let me get a piece of paper. Um, I, um, I am kind of like an organized um, OCD kind of thing. Let me straighten this out a little bit. And um, I want, this is our Sunday bulletins, okay? And we have um, some, uh, he leave, um, a pastor leaves uh, empty spots. And so, anyway, I like to save this part. And let me cut it out because, um, I'll show you what I'm going to do. I, I did some pages and I'm like, I'm not really sure that I care for that. So I'm more than likely going to change it. I'm telling you, I'm going to change it. But I want to save these because um, I am going to go through it and write down the scriptures for each Sunday that he's went over. And my little notes kind of things. Um, let's see. We're going to just do this. I think. Too late now. Alright. So what I'm going to do next is I got to think this through because I've already changed my mind. I've already started it in the book, but I'm going to um, change those out and do it this way. So I'm going to glue the back down. I'm going to glue it on here because I like to be able to go through and um, go through Sunday service and take my notes from it. Um, after the fact because I don't want to note take during because I feel like I'm going to miss something if I'm doing notes prior to. You know, like when he's talking and I'm thinking in my head, oh, I need to write that down. Well, by the time I write everything down and I'm thinking in my head, then um, I've, I've already missed what the next line was that he said. You know what I'm saying? So, anywho, I wonder if, I tell you what, I'm just going to stick it down and cut around it because I don't want to make um, a mess. It's just as easy just to do it this way because what I want to do, I think, ooh, I only have one chance to do this. I mean, I could re-glue and all the things, but I don't want to have to do that. So what I'm going to do, because I can't see. Let's see, where is the line? There it is. Um, all right. And then I'm going to do the bottom the same way. I gotta think how this is gonna come out. Um, okay, so what I think I wanna do, I've gotta figure out which side I wanna leave and which side I'm not gonna leave. All right, so um, this is how I did it, and then I put pages behind it, but I don't think I want to do that. I think, let me get this, I'm going to do it differently, and it's okay that I've glued them on here already because I'll cut them. I think I want to make it like a, where it opens up like this, and I can 
behind it and on it and I don't have to worry about it. Is that what I want to do? Huh. Now I'm questioning myself. Or do I want it to open this way? Yeah, I want it to open this way. That's the way I want it to open. So. All right. So. Let's cut this side off. So hard to see. just going to need oh, I can't see here um, let me um, put a pencil mark right here and right there because I cannot see the white on white okay I just need a fourth of an inch really I don't need a long piece. Let's just do that. And then whoa. Let's do this. do it this way and just be done with it and then I can open it and write. I kind of like that idea. Rather than, you know, I love that. So, let's see if I have a some tape that will fit this. I love it. And then I can make it look pretty. I can make it look pretty. Yes, I can. Because that's what we do, right? That's what we can do. I don't know why I do things I, like I do. I don't even know, but that's just me. That's just me. I'm going to leave that out because I'm going to go ahead and work on the other ones while I'm at it. But... Let's do this first. All right. So I want to, I want to um, line up on that line. That's pretty straight. So we're going to do this. And then I will get the eraser. And erase as much of that as I can. It's not a big deal, y'all. It's not a big deal. Okay. So now it opens up like this. And then I can write up here what service that is. So let me... Oh gosh, this was Sunday's service. Um, June the 30th, June the 30th. Let me get, no, let me get. Let's see. Let's see. That is so little. I'm going to use that one. The nib is about number two. And this is going to be, yeah, that's good. June the 30th, 2024. 
and I don't have the best handwriting, but I'm okay with that. So I'm going to put it up here, June the 30th, 2024. Perfect. There. I'm going to leave that out because I am going to do another one. But why not put a little piece of washi tape right there just to snazz it up a little bit. I don't know why I do the things I do, but yeah, I know sometimes it's just a, um, a little something. All right, I'm gonna need this. be different so it's okay all right now I want to go over I, I know y'all could probably hear the lawnmower my husband's outside mowing he's mowing Ugh. do a very good job at getting it straight but that's okay too just kind of cut that little side off with the pokey tool and I love it I love it and once it lays in the book it'll be flat and so when I take my, when I do my stuff, it's going to look really good. So let's, oh, wait, this is Wednesday or Sunday. And I made a um, Sunday mornings thing to go on top of there like that. Okay, so let's put that aside. And uh, this is our mission for the church. All right, I'm going to pull all of these out and redo them because this is not how I wanted it to look. I do want to keep the mission in there. I like that. So there's that. Okay, so now I need one sheet of paper. Okay, so I'll start out with this one. And I will start out with this one. Okay, all right. This should go pretty fast since I already know what I'm gonna do, right? Let's cut the bottom. No, I can't see it because it's, it's right on the, um, white on white, man. I can't see that. I'm going to go across that a little bit more. There we go. Alright. And then I'm going to cut that right there. This is June the 2nd. I don't want to forget that. And then... I know 
I don't know if y'all can hear my TV in the living room. I have it on music. And, um, all right, so we're going to put that right there. And cut it. And fold it over on itself. And then I can put this tape on there. And get that done. Wednesday night service is a whole lot different because we get a full sheet. I'll show it to you. Wednesday night Bible study is a little bit different. Uh oh. So, um, there's that. Um, I don't care if I get it in the same spot. Let's see, one, two, three. I'm not going to be that, um, you know, I'm not going to be that picky. So, oh, I cut it smaller, that's why it looks a little different. can open it like this and close it like that. Let's put a little washi tape on here. Let's do different colors. Why not, right? I'll do that last. So this is June the 2nd. June the 2nd. This is June the 2nd, 20. 24. All right. Yay. Well, let's just do it because I want it to do my fingernails, y'all, are so stinking short. Let me tell you what I did. I was not going to put shellac. Shellac is a gel polish. It's just the name brand. It's by Creative Nails. Um, and, um, well, uh, don't ever, ever, ever peel it off. I'm just saying, don't peel it off because you will have a mess on your hands. Your fingernails will come off with it if you peel that polish off. So, what did I do? I peeled the polish off and it made my, the tips of my nails really, really thin. And I thought, oh no, I'm just going to leave it off for a while. And I even peeled this one off into the quick. It was not good. It was not good. So I thought, oh Lord. And so for a day and a half or whatever, I tried to live with it. I'm just going to tell you right now. I could not live with it. I couldn't. I could not live with it. So, um, I had to go ahead and put some shellac back on. And the pain is gone because the sensitivity has, um, is, um, is better since I covered it up. Look how pretty that is. That is so pretty. I love it, y'all. I just love it. All right. Um, June 9. June 9. Put this away so I don't get confused. All right. So, let's cut this. All right there. 
Jewel Night Sunday. I don't need to put it on there Sunday because I know what it is. Alright. I can't see. Can't see. My husband is going to town with that lawnmower. I'm telling you right now. He is just having a ball. He, I think he loves it, honestly, because he sits behind a computer all day and um, I'm going to mark that so I can see. And so he loves every stinking chance he can get to go outside. I'm not kidding. He um, just loves to be outside. And I don't blame him because, you know, he is um, behind that computer all day long. I'm going to put that mark about right there. So he's behind that computer all day. And he's got to get some reprieve from that. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, right? He just has to have, he loves to be outdoors. He makes the biggest garden you can think of. I mean, he has a huge garden. I am not that good. Look at my mistake, I made a boo-boo. But that's okay too, mistakes are okay. All right, so let's put this down. And um, anyway, he's outside mowing. We have some friends coming down tomorrow and stay until Sunday. And tomorrow is Wednesday, July 3rd. And um, so I'm excited about that. I'm really excited about that. Yesterday, my my husband's off all week for the 4th of July week. He took vacay. And so, I was like, yesterday, I was like, babe, can you help me do this, this, and this? And he's like, he didn't complain or nothing. He just did it. He um, is wonderful. He is so wonderful, y'all. I am, I mean, you know, he vacuumed and did all these things for me so that I could get some other stuff done, and um, I dusted, oh, I hate to dust, just throwing that out there, I'm just throwing that out there, me and Dustin are not friends, but once it's done, it's like, oh gosh, so I got the guest room all clean and pretty, and all of that and um, I love I got to go get some candy or something some stuff to lay on the bed I like to put a card and on the bed and maybe some candy or I put it on the dresser with some candy and um, you know I like to make them feel really special when I make do the rooms for the guest. I just think it's awesome. Okay, 24 minutes of me rambling. But this is what I'm doing and I just wanted to take y'all along with me. Because, well, uh -oh. because I can and I wanted to. I thought y'all might enjoy this. Uh-oh. Dang, dang, dang. All right, that's not gonna fly, not gonna fly. Ugh. That won't fly at all. Ugh. Oh my gosh, I'm so picky. If I could peel it off, I would, but I don't think I can. 
Oh, this is a perfect match. That'll work. I can't sweat the small stuff, right? That looks nice. Look at that. Just perfect. And then that opens like that. All right, this is June the 9th. June 9, 2024. And I'm not worried about the handwriting. Okay, June 9th goes there. We have two more to go. I have two more. I hope y'all don't mind hanging out with me while I'm doing this. Two more to go. We're going to cut it right there. June the 16th is next. Let's cut this right there. And then I'm gonna take this right up to here. I think I wanna do that. Cause I don't need, um, there's that. And then we'll take this, um, the edge of the paper is right there. So we'll do that and fold it over. Very good. So anyway, um, I just thought of this the other day, and so I don't have, I wish I had um, all of them since I've been there because he started a new series. And I don't have all of those. I imagine I could get them, a copy of them, but I don't want to put anybody out. Too much trouble. So this one is June 16th, June 16th, 2024. Okay. Whoa, and let's stick it down. All right, I don't think that one. Let's do some washi, washi tape. Is that one close to the end? I love washi tape. Whoa. Well, I messed that one up. show you Wednesday nights. So we have one more to go and then I'm done with this. Until next week. Till Sunday. Probably can see my head. I don't know. There. That's going to look good. Use 
your pokey tool as a tool to cut. That looks good. Okay, June 16th, right there. And then one more, one more, yay! One more, and then we can put it in the book. June 23rd. June 23rd, I can't see. June 23rd. And June 23rd. Uh, okay, like that. Close enough as to I'm gonna get it. Last one, y'all, last one. Um got some Barry Manilow in there playing. I love that song. You know, when I was growing up, when I was in uh when I was young, I always, always, always had music um, in, okay, this is 16th, June, June 23rd. twenty twenty four. I always had music on, always, forever. I would sit in my room and um, have my stereo on. It was, it almost looked like a coffee table back then. My mother had it in the living room and she decided she didn't want it anymore. It was the best gift she ever gave me was to put this little stereo. It was like, um, it almost looked like a coffee table. It was about this wide. I don't know that you could tell. It was probably 18 inches wide and it was really long, and it wasn't probably, I don't know, coffee table height on the floor, and it had um, three big um, pieces of marble on top in three sections, and then you pulled this big drawer out, and there was a stereo with the record player over here, and then over here was the music for the radio. And I'm like, oh man, how perfect for me, because, you know, I'm a music lover, and I had to have the music, man. It was fantastic. It was great, and I loved it. When I was young, the only way my mama could get me to go to sleep at night was she had a little bitty radio in my crib. I always loved the music. Always, always, always. And I continued to do that. And um, it was wonderful. So, um, anyway. So, I have a love for the music. And I love, like, the 70s is where I'm stuck at in the music world. I love the 70s other than my gospel music. And the gospel, my absolute favorite with the gospel is the Bill Gaither. That's, I love that um, Bill Gaither station on uh, Pandora. But I also love Lauren Daigle. Um, there's a, you can put on in the Amazon music, you can put Lauren Daigle station 
and it'll play music similar to hers. And I love that one too. It just depends on what kind of mood I am because that is way, that is two different genres for sure. That is like way too different. Two different, two different. There. That is beautiful. I'm so happy with this. This, I was laying in bed the other night, and I'm like, Lord, you know, I, I don't know that I like it that way, the way I had it. I want it to look different. And so, this is what I came up with. And I'm like, thank you, Lord, it's his idea. Because he knew what would make me happy. And this definitely makes me happy. All right. So there. And in between each one let's put two sheets just in case I get a little crazy on wanting to take notes but I can always add more to the papers all right two and then one two and then One, two. All right, y'all. This has somewhat of a thing for journaling, right? Uh-oh, which one did I not cut off? This one. Not that you will see it, but... Let me fix this. Put it in the book. Let's put it in the book. Put that cover before it dries out on me. All right. I love it. I love it. There we go. And these little folders are like a dollar at um, Dollar General. Okay, I'm back. Um, so here we go. Look how cute. That is so stinking cute. Look at that. I love it. All right, this is what I wanted it to do. So there's that. And then I will put Sunday morning on here. And then, just a minute, Ellie. And then, here's Wednesday night in blue. And this is Wednesday night stuff. It comes out printed like this. So, um, just a minute, baby. Just a minute. There's that. Like that. So, that's Wednesday night's in a blue book and there's that I may put it in a black because I, I like the way the black looks but anyway so there is my little bit of fun um, my little bit of gotta get things organized kind of deal that really turned out cute I love it listen I had to go because I I cut my finger on these little deals right across there so y'all be careful when you mess with these i had in all the years that i've messed with these books never have i cut my finger and i didn't want to do that because you know i've got a lot going on and i don't want my finger to be all messed up while i'm got company but it is what it is now say hello ellie she's gonna get a bath in a little bit she doesn't know it yet she doesn't mind them, but she doesn't really care for them either. This my girl. Yeah. All right. So, um, go lay down. Go 
Good girl. All right. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, it's just me rambling and messing around with my stuff. Getting ready for all my church stuff. So y'all take care. Love you bunches. Oh, also don't forget that I have tons of hymnals for sale. They're $8 a piece. Shipping is either going to be $6 or $7. I can only ship in the U.S. Come over to my Facebook page and um, you can join that. Give me a private message and let me know how many you want and we'll work out all the details. What I normally do is you send me your email address and your mailing address and then through p your email I will send you an invoice from PayPal and it works out just great. So just send me a um, come check them out y'all on my Facebook page there's a picture of a box full of a bin huge bin full of hymnals so if you want some hymnals for your junk journals come check it out it goes towards our um, food pantry slash building fund so uh, I'm just you know they have all these journals uh, I mean these hymnals and I said hey I could sell those to go towards our building fund for the um, food pantry and so they boxed them up for me and here we are so just let me know if you want them i um uh go i like to go through messenger um through facebook messenger so y'all go check it out and let me know what you if you want any so thanks bunches everybody god bless talk to you real soon